America, welcome to USA News' Nightly News Hour, America's top viewed and most trusted news source. Breaking news just in, new scientific discovery to change the world of mobile heating and cooling. This scientific discovery is quickly being paired into 21st century technology as cell phone cases are equipped to heat and cool the cell phone and the immediately surrounding environment. This just after foreign leadership of Star Island announced their launch of a similar coveted technology. However, a recent statement by co-head scientist Mr. Wendlin from 4th Hour Laboratories stated in regards to their new heating and cooling technology for Star Islands, and I quote, Let's be clear. This is landing on the moon compared to their brushing the surface of space. Clear apple to their Samsung, a true American innovation. We take you now to USA News' very own reporter, Benjamin Moore, in an interview at 4th Hour Laboratories with head scientists Mr. Wenlin and Jennifer Zempke. Ben. Thanks, Braden. I'm here today at 4th Hour Laboratories with head scientist Jennifer Zemke and Eric Wenlin, who have stumbled upon a revolutionary find. Describe what took place here to our viewers at home and describe what new product this is and what it'll do for our consumers at home. Well, these new cell phone cases are absolutely brilliant. Normally, cell phones are at risk for being damaged in extreme temperatures. These cases fix that problem in an ingenious manner. Our winter case protects your phone from being too cold while warming up your hands. Our summer case protects your phone from overheating while cooling down your hands. These cases will prolong the life of your device as extreme temperatures are the number one cause of damage. Wow, this seems revolutionary. Can you describe some of the specifics of this technology to our viewers at home? Well, you see, Ben, our phone harnesses the power of chemistry. I can't tell you all the specifics, but here are some of the basics. We use calcium chloride to heat the phones and potassium nitrate to cool the phones. We have multiple different designs, but I can describe to you our most popular models. The shivery sheaf and piping protector. When a button is pressed, depending on the style, potassium nitrate or calcium chloride is added to the water. In the winter model, when the button is pressed, calcium chloride is added to the water, which warms up the case. In the summer model, when the button is pressed, potassium nitrate is added to the case, cooling it down. So how do you integrate both potassium nitrate and calcium chloride into a single case? Can you give me some of the specifics on the design? Well, you see, Ben, the design is simple and sleek. We have cases for every size and shape of smartphone. On the back of the case, there is a button. When this button is pressed, the chemical compound is released into the water inside the case. The case is made of silicone, so it holds heat very efficiently. One press will provide a sufficient temperature change. The owner will have to buy replacement packs as they only have a one-time use. Our case is also drop proof from up to 100 feet. It comes in a variety of colors. Also, this case will revolutionize the phone accessory industry and is a must buy for this coming holiday season. Thank you, Mr. Wendland. Dr. Zemke, will you delve into some of the specifics of the actual chemical reaction to some of our viewers? Well, although developing the product was quite difficult, making it work is quite simple. All you need is the correct cell phone case and your phone. In the shivery sheet, an endothermic reaction occurs when you Although it may seem dangerous to be putting a case full of water on your phone, the designs have been tweaked and redesigned so that no damage to the phone occurs. Similarly, the piping protector allows calcium chloride to mix with the water in a safe and controlled way so that your phone and hands are never able to get uncomfortable. This causes the end of exothermic reaction, which means the potential energy is higher at the beginning of the reaction than at the end of the reaction. Well, in order for the shivery sheath to become cold, a chemical reaction must occur. As you already know, the case has a water pack inside of it, but inside the water pack there is a capsule of potassium nitrate. In order to start the reaction, you need an up activation energy for it to begin. Um, what, what you get through pressing the button on the back of the phone and thus breaking the chemical part and allowing it to mix with the water. The delta H of the reaction is positive. The energy is being absorbed, which allows your phone case to cool down to a temperature that will not harm the actual phone. On the other hand, an exothermic reaction is observed in the piping protector. In exothermic reaction, heat is absorbed by the calcium chloride heating up the water. The exothermic reaction has a negative delta H, meaning that heat is being released in the form of energy, which means it can heat up the reaction. The reaction can take place as soon as the calcium chloride is released into the phone case and mixes with the water to form calcium and 2 chloride. Well, thank you for the intro on your project, Dr. Zemke. And you too, Mr. Wendland. Back to you at USA News headquarters. Thanks, Ben. There you have it, America. The world's scientific thermodynamic chemistry meets the consumer and the market. 
integrating both exothermic reactions, as in the Piper protector, with the mixing of water and calcium chloride, releasing heat, and endothermic reactions, as in the Schiffer sheet, with the mixing of water and potassium nitrate, absorbing heat and emitting coolness. This is appallingly innovative, the next top item on my wish list. This concludes tonight's breaking news. We'd like to thank 4th Hour Laboratories, head scientists Eric Wenland and Jennifer Wudzemke, reporter Moore, and all of our viewers and sponsors. This has been USA News' Nightly News Hour, America's top view and most trusted news source. When we return, we'll cover the 2050 presidential election live on The Pinto Show with guest Republican presidential nominee Brady Van Dyke. Thank you and good night.